Howdy, 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 y'all, and welcome back to some more Journey of Life, where I figured today we'll do a little bit more base building. I'm, today's going to be more of a tutorial for some of the most commonly asked questions that I have had on the channel, either in streams or in the comments below. So if you have a question you want answered, be sure and leave it, and I will do my best to get it done for you. So we're going to first work on uh, getting how to make the hinges, I think it's hinges and the iron hoops which was a question that I got quite a bit. So we're going to start with getting our forge ready. We're also, once we get this set up, I'm going to go through all the admin commands that I know so far to kind of show you guys some of the admin commands in case you get stuck in like a bug or a glitch and you lose a bunch of your stuff and you don't want to have to grind it out again just so you don't get discouraged. And if you know, there is a way to get it all back without having to spend endless hours. Now, I don't recommend using some of these commands unless, like, I don't know. Like, for me, when you use all these commands, it kind of takes some of the fun out of the game. Excuse you, Forge, I'm going to need you to want to place for me, please. Really? Really. All the way out there, but not here. Really. I object. Okay, well, fine. I guess that's fine. Uh, yeah, right there, we'll do just fine. We should have 25 clay bricks here. I made those up before we started. Actually, you know, let's hit X and scoot you over a little bit more. Let's scooch. Yeah, actually, I know, I know, I'm indecisive. If I'm kind of all over the place and a little bit rambly today, I had to take some uh, fever medicine because I have been running a fever all day today. So, fun stuff, but I needed to still get an episode done. This is all the loot we got from the chest, but this is what I'm looking for. Actually, let's go ahead and swap an axe out for that, which will automatically stack it to 9, so you don't have to do the one 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 one. If you take something from your inventory and pull it over, uh, I'll show you again. Like, wooden hammer, two chests, now I have a stack of 10. If you're just pulling one over at a time, you get literally one at a time, so... Uh, let's get you back, and let's get you back, and then doing the same, always from he the inventory to the chest, that's how you get it. If you go from chest to inventory, you'll only get one at a time. So like here, I can't even restack that to ten, because it just wants to do it in ones. So, just a little tippy-doo there for you. So let's go ahead and run over here, get our forge hammered out right quick, and then we will go over admin commands, and then we will get back to making the anvil, and how to make the iron hoops, and the hinges and such. Um, you can also, if you want to, you can... All these shipwrecks so far, I've been through like a lot of them. And they always have the exact same loot in all of them, which you can always hit X on any of the chests. I think there was what? A one, two, three, four, five, six chests in that one shipwreck right here. So, I mean, you can always hit X, pick up the chest from the ship and move it. That's how I get my beginning chest at the first of the game. So, some might think of it as cheaty. I think of it as using what the game has given me. It gave me the ability to hit X and pick up the item, and it's given me the sunken treasure loot. So, you know what? The chest is considered part of the loot, in my humble opinion. Bam! Got our forge. Nailed it. Okay, let's go grab some coal. I don't have a whole lot. You need to go find more coal. Uh, yeah, that'll be enough. That'll do just fine. So, we're going to drag that back here, and it's going to make a wooden fire pit kind of thing, which kind of makes me giggle. I'm going to drop that there. And then we also need to get the anvil popped out, so let's get the anvil going, and then we'll have some fun with some admin commands. Uh, and here, place. I don't know if I'm going to be able to use all of them, because I don't have my settlement set up. Oh, I should have done this on my other world. That would have made a whole lot more sense, huh? Um, but I kind of wanted to do a two-for-one, because I am on, like, cold and flu medicine right now. I don't know what I have, but I feel quite crummy, I must say. So, um... And let's go... Yeah, there. You don't want this to be too far from the forge, otherwise your ingots are going to get cold. One log block and three iron ingots. Ooh, do I even have three iron ingots? We found it in the chest, but I don't remember how many we got. Was it this one? We have two. That's okay. Uh, we can make some more. Easy peasy. I don't think I have an ingot mold yet, do I? Um... Molds, where are you? Small mill? Uh, no, we do not. So let's grab some clay up from right here. Run over jar and ingot mold right there. Nail it out. Bam! Oh, I always hit tab instead of E. Here, if you boil salt water, uh, you get a salt rock. You don't get any drinkable water. So I was doing an experiment and that is what happened. I am going to experiment more on can I break the salt? Does the salt go in soup? Like, what is the purpose of the salt? We're going to do like a whole thing on that. Uh, let's put you in there. Let's grab some firewood and pop you in here. And there. Let's grab our fire starter. Which is probably over by our smelter. Sure is. Let's grab you. 
Let's actually go ahead and grab another stack of sticks to put in the smelter. I could have grabbed coal. Uh, that would make a whole lot more sense, but too late to apologize. Um, and let's get our fire starter in our hand. Go right here. Get that baked, and we'll keep our fire starter on us because we're going to need it. We need this one wooden block. And then that should be done by now. Uh, doop, doop, baked. Nailed it. Let's throw you right here. And I believe it's five iron ingots. So let's pull our iron noses. One, two, three, four, five. You don't have to change this. It'll automatically change it for you once you put them in. And let's get this started up. Uh-huh. There we go. Okay, so if you hit enter, you can see I already have creative mode enabled on that. I did that earlier to make sure I even remember the command because it's been a while. It was in a stream that somebody told me about it. But if you want to do creative mode, you can do forward slash enable creative. Ooh, I can learn how to English too. Mode, enter, and then you can hit page up. Oh, I just disabled it. My bad. My bad. Let's try that again. Er, enable creative mode, enter. Okay, now it's enabled. Page up. And then here are the things that you can just click on to throw into your inventory. Uh, stop moving page or screen. So here's like clay bricks, limestone bricks, cloth, uh, dry glass, dry glass, dry grass blades, some copper hinges and copper plates. There's some wiring and all sorts of goodies. This kind of, like I said, it will take the fun out of the grind. But if you're a person like my husband that absolutely hates the grind and just wants to build, 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 this is probably for you. So yeah, that's all the stuff you can get. And not everything in the game is in creative mode, but some things are. It does not take your food or water off or anything like that. It just allows you to spawn those items in. So let's go ahead and get our ingot picked up. Because we need you, man. Let's get our hammer back in our hand. Let's smash out this anvil right quick. Ta-da! Hey, I said it right this time. Um, okay. Another command is forward slash where, which will give you your coordinates, X, Y, and Z. So if you were like an old school Minecraft player, you know how to read those coordinates and get where you need to go. Let's go ahead and eat because we're thirsting a little bit here. Uh, so yeah, that's good stuff. And you can always enter again to bring them back up. That's convenient when you're trying to find like each other in a multiplayer world. You can also do, um, wow, I just went a blank. Oh, forward slash day three. Is it space? Oh, now I'm jumping. I'm super excited. Day, space, three. There it is. And it will make it rain. Not money or dollar bills, y'all, but, you know, it will make it rain actual water from the sky, which now I feel like I cheated because my water collectors are going to be all full. Um, <laughs> forward slash day, zero, space, zero, will turn the rain off. There is also uh, forward slash time, I'll get like 0800 will make it 8 a.m. So if you're not by your bed and you need to sleep through the night real quick, this works on single player and automatically if you're the host on a multiplayer world, you can make it whatever time you want. If you want to make it nighttime, daytime, whatever tickles your fancy. And then the one, I, I don't know if this will work, but we'll try it. Because I don't have my dock set up, this one might not work. This one I learned from PJanks, and I'll put a link to his page in the description below. And it is, um, I think it's Create Attacker. Like I said, that may, I don't think it will work since we don't have a dock. Pretty sure it won't. Is it create attacker or is it enable attacker? Ooh, that's a good question. Enable, we attacker. Uh, no, I don't think it'll work because we don't have a dock. So, let me finish doing this and then I'll... Uh, cut away and go to my other world so I can show you the um, how to get the pirates and such in uh, But like I said, that was a command that we learned from P. Jenks So I'll put a link to his page in the description below so that you guys can go check him out He's got good journey life content going up daily right about the same time as mine So you can get like a two-for-one Go check his out then stop by and pop in and watch mine. you know you need that extra journey of life fix It is there to be had we got y'all um, let's go ahead and grab, oh, no, 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 let's get our ingot going, so let's go ahead and grab, oh, I'm going to need to make some more iron, one, two, 
three. And I know you can drag and draw or like shift click these in, but I don't want seven in. I think it will only fill the five. But for me, they always like popples all over the place, and then I'm spending more time picking them up than I would have been if I would have just dropped them in one by one. So that's why I don't shift click them in. Personal preference, that's all there is. Let's go ahead and throw these on because we need to break these up to get some more iron going. So raw iron, you're going to pickaxe into, or actually, I'm sorry, iron ore, you're going to pickaxe into raw iron. And then you'll have to bake it, of course. And then from baked iron, you can hit it up again, and you will have iron uh, noses, which is what they look like to me. Uh, okay, that is done. Your um, molds only last so long. Let's go ahead and open this up, and let's throw in five is what it will take. So three, four, five. Let's close that. You gotta have the heat up. Let's go ahead and, I want to see, can I break the salt rock up to make, like, salt for us to put in our, no, you cannot. Okay, it was just an experiment I wanted to do. I'm going to assume that we just dropped that in the soup pot to make better uh, stew. I, I got nothing. Do I have the hammer on us? Oh, we do. Okay, so let's go over here to the porridge, make sure it's good and hot. By looking at it, the little gas can tells you how hot, it, or how full it is with fuel. To the left of it is how high it is. So we're going to drop our iron ingot in. Do not leave ingots in when you log out of the game because the forge will eat them all. Uh, fun fact. I had like 15 in mine, or I think it was like 10. I'm exaggerating, and the forge ate them when I logged back in. So let's go ahead and go here, and then, as you can see, iron hoop, iron plate, iron sheet, iron hinge. So we're going to go ahead and roll, scroll down with your mouse wheel to it and hit E, and then you're going to mash it out. You are going to have to heat this up again until you have a blacksmith hammer or um, one of the more advanced hammers, because this one is super, super slow, so it will take a hot minute to... Uh, get it all mashed out. I'm hoping they add sound effects to it soon. I believe that is in the works. I want to hear like some ding ding ding, maybe some sizzle from the sparks flying off, you know, all the fun stuff that blacksmiths get to hear. I want to experience it and immerse myself in the life that is Journey. I need to upgrade my uh, firewood maker anyway, so you know, two birds, one stone and all. You can usually get to where you only have like three hits left and then you have to heat it up again. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh, see, starting colors. Oh, see, I have like one hit, maybe two left, and it got too cold. So, let's just look over it. Perfect. We're going to pick it up with our bigger hands, because that makes total sense. And voila, we got our iron hoops. Now, let's run over to our firewood maker. Let's hit tab and upgrade you. And... All the wrong buttons. Oh, I don't have my hammer in my hand, do I? I? No, I do have my hammer in my hand. Iron hoop. Um, excuse you. Oh, my hammer's broke. That's why. Okay, let's go grind it up real quick. Grind it up. But yeah, you can do the same thing with hinges and plates and such of that nature. And then I will pop over to my other world. I might, yeah, I'll pop over to my other world. Um, I need to repair a lot of this stuff, too. Uh, let's go ahead and repair that real quick, just by hitting it with a hammer. Bam. Alright, that's repaired enough for us to get this done. That's what it was. Okay, now everything is upgraded. All good to go. we got to get more, working on more of our base of operations, but I'm not... I mean, we can get all the machines and stuff made. We're going to move them into the um, settlements buildings uh, in the next upcoming episode, so... That'll be fun. So hang tight just a moment. Oh, my fire's going out. And I will bring you guys back when I get into the other world. And we are back in my Season 1 world that I'm holding on to. It's buggy and glitchy, but I'm still holding on to it. So an attempt that one day the buggy and the glitchy worlds will be fixed and I can jump back into this one and we can carry on. Because I love what we did here. Also wanted to show you, people were asking about, somebody had mentioned on the Discord in uh, JOL about the... The lady that made the walkways, and I'm assuming they talked about me. So I did the one meter uh, stone, the one meter stone planks, no, one meter wood plank walkways that kind of look like railroad tracks. I'm going to get those finished. It just takes a lot of grind to get all those done and a lot of time to line them up properly. Like I have one that's out of whack. So I got to take all these out and get those fixed. I like to add little things that don't actually belong, but kind of snazz up the place. And then this is our flat stone, like stepping stone walkway, which we've got that goes to our front door. 
Good stuff. Right. Okay. Let's run out towards our dock so that we can do the um, pirate command. And there is a command that I don't know if it even exists, but I'm just going to assume it should or maybe it does. So we're going to pop that one in too. Only because if you can do pirates, then shouldn't you be able to do settlers? Like, would make sense. And again, if I didn't thank you personally by name for a command that you gave me in a stream or on a comment, I apologize for that. But I was given so many different commands, and a lot of the same ones, um, by so many people. It would probably take the 20 minutes just to thank everybody by name personally. So, uh, yeah, I, I really sorry. The only one that I remember, like, off the top of my head was PJanks and the create attacker command. So, sorry about me. I love y'all, though. Uh, and yeah, it would take a lot of time, too, to go through every video and look at the comments and figure... I do that sometimes, and I'll make notes on who said what, but... Uh, yeah, who's it to what's it galore, I don't feel good enough to do, and I apologize. Big time for that. So let's go create a tacker. No, that's a tackler. Attack. Hooked on products. Worked for me! Is that what it is? Yeah. Whoa, why is my attacker... Okay, there he is. He's dressed. I want to know why I can't have his clothing. I don't even have a weapon on me. Oh no! Oh no! I didn't grab a weapon! Uh, mistakes were made! Mistakes were made! Hold on! Hold on! I took my backpack off because this world always glitches and I lose my backpack even though I had the blow. The blow? Wow! The bow in the chest! Um, but yeah, my backpack always disappears so I empty my inventory out before I log out of this world. Just follow me, Mr. Pirate, sir. Uh, let me grab a weapon to murder you with. You wouldn't mind, um, like, letting me borrow your sword, would you? Oh, you are right behind me! Talk about being stabbed in the back, if that could easily take place. Come on, you can run faster than this. I believe in you! Go, go, go! No, no, no? Okay, fine. Fine! We're just gonna mosey on our way and hopefully we don't get murdered along the way. Now, where did I put my pack back? And do- oh, now we're thirsting to death. I know that's not the real way you say it, but it amuses me to say thirsting to death. Uh, what is there? Oh, he got stuck somewhere. Yay! Pirate? Where are you be? Um. Valid question, Pirate. I wonder if he ran up there. Because my uh, settlers ran up there. And crossed, like, way on that side. They went across the bridge. Oh, he's on the other side of the bridge. So, noted. Your pirates can... If you go... If your dock is where mine is, they can get up that hill, no problem. You just have to go watch them. A lot of times they will get stuck. Do I have any food on us? I do not. And here we are, about to dehydrate to death before I can even finish showing you guys what I'm trying to show you guys. So, um, water? Water? I usually keep water there. Where's my water? Uh, let's just go take water from the settlers that don't live here because they all died. Because apparently I'm a horrible, horrible host. Okay, we are completely out of stamina. Come on, you can do it. Left foot, right foot, I believe in you. Here's a storage room. And yay, water. Let's grab that. Put it in our hand. We're just going to like slurp out of this real quick. Don't mind me. Glug, 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 glug. Ah, much better. Okay. And we're off to see the pirate. Not the wizard. The wonderful wizard of Oz. You're welcome for putting that song in your head, by the way. Ay, now it's dark 30. Okay, hold on. Oh, wait, no, look. We can just do this. Time, oh, not tow, time, oh, 800, you know what, 900 is fine, too. Ta-da, I have mystical, mystical, I have mystical, magical powers. Nailed it. Why don't you thirst to death, like, overnight, Mr. Pirate, sir? I feel like that's a little cheaty. That my settlers die almost instantly of thirst. I, I do know how to fix that now, though, so do not fret. Uh, we will have all that handled in Season 2. Um, let's just murder him real quick. Hey, buddy! Do you have an eye patch on? Oh, you do! I never noticed that! And you are the worst. Your tribe is under attack. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is like the most derpy oh. fight ever. Oh, oh, where are you running to? Oh. <laughs> it amuses me so. Why can I not have his clothing? I feel like I should be able to have his clothing. Okay, let's run back here. I want to try one more command. I don't even know if it exists, but out of just curiosity, I need to try it. And I figure since we do our Let's Play and Learns together, I'll bring y'all along to try it with me. Together. I'm not going to see High School Musical right now. Me throat is on fire. <gasps> we got new settlers! What? 
Hi guys! No way! Follow! Follow! P. Jinx, you are the man. He is the one that told us about the pirate command that resets the settlers. I have done this so many times. Hey, my dude, up here. And my settlers never came back. Oh, good stuff! Okay, so it does work. Come on! Up here! You can do it. Right up this hill. Oh, yay! We have Jeremy and Gemster back! Yay! Okay, so... Oh, I wanted to try... Oh, well, that, I can't really try that new command, can I? I guess I can. Hold on. Let's go forward slash... Um, was it create attacker? I think it was. So, can we create... Settler? Wait, settler? Is that a thing? I feel like I spelled that wrong. I blame the cold medicine. I don't know if that's a thing. Uh, but hey, look at us! We got... God, you guys look half stoned out of your mind. Blink. Blink. Oh my god, they need help. Can I set you a job? Uh, yeah, you can be a logger. And you also logger. I need wood for days and not y'all's wood. I do not want y'all's wood for days. Y'all look like you've been through a bit. Uh, wait. Oh, no, no. I need you to come with me so you can pick up an axe and then you can start logging. Oh, come on. You're not that smart. Uh, stop. Follow. Stop. Follow. Sheepers, creepers. Let's get them home, y'all. And let me, uh, Oh, so, oh, now the struggle is really real. Do I continue on season one? I must have spent 12 hours in game waiting for settlers to arrive, and they never did. And I must have spawned in, I don't even know how many pirates. I finally just started throwing the pirate swords over in the water, hoping they would despawn one day. Um, can you guys come this way, or are you going to go the long way again? Come on. No, you're not, you're not going to come this way, are you? Okay, so then you're going to go this way? Definitely build on this side if you want the settlers to get to you easier. Come on! You can do it! Y'all did it last time. Come on. Alright, last time I ran across and they found a way to me. So let's see if that works. Are you still following? You are. Okay, so... Come on before you thrust yourself to death. Let's open you. We have two more settlers. That is super hot sight. Oh, man. Now I feel like we should just continue with Season 1. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Do we jump back to Season 1 and I can just replace building or machines that stop working as needed? Oh, see, get the runner down. They're going to run all the way down there and then run across the water up there. It's so funny. Run, Boris, run! See, so yeah, let me know in the comments below. Do we just continue on Season 1? Or do we just keep on keeping on on Season 2? Like, I'm very curious what you guys want to do. I'm good either way, honestly. Totally groovy both ways. Yay! Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And as always, before I go, remember, when gaming, have fun, play hard, but in real life, get the change you wish to see in the world. Run, bunny, run! Let's get them some axes. I've never actually had settlers work before, so let's hurry up and get them thirsted and fooded and all that fun stuff. Oh, I'm so excited. Are you guys okay? Like, is your health... Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, yes, you're, you're okay. So, I think I have axes on the ground in here. I think I have to put it in front of them. I think that's what P. Jinx also had said. Uh, storage. Let's see. Um, yep, axes for days. Right there. Set job. Logger. Set job. Logger. Are you getting one? Oh, you, no, you got the crappy one out of all... Oh, he got the good one. He was smart enough. Yeah! Later, y'all. Hold on, hold on. Let's see what they do. Mine died last time, so I'm super excited right now. I, I know, don't judge that the tavern's not built, y'all. Uh, see, that what happened was, is that a couple of your second cousins twice removed came last week, or maybe the week before, and they died instantly. So I thought maybe alcohol poisoning had to do with it, so we stopped building the tavern. We'll finish it, though, if you guys can um, prove to be worthy of Fort Destiny. Or no, we're Terminus here, aren't we? Oh, look at him go! Are you going to cut the same tree? You're not that dumb, are you? You are that dumb. <laughs> Teamwork makes a dream work. Later, y'all.